the the ones that you do love, you know, there's a special place because you 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 make these movies in the hope that they'll be timeless. I mean, that was always kind of my mantra as a writer and as a director. I always wanted movies, even when I was writing movies like Gremlins and Goonies and, and then getting into Adventures in Babysitting and Home Alone. You wanted those movies to feel sort of timeless. I thought of, ahead in 25 years, 30 years, when people are watching them on TV, I want them to feel as if they were made yesterday. You know, some of the clothes are going to be dated, that sort of thing. But at the same time, I wanted them to still feel fresh. Um, so that was very important to me. No one favorite, no. All, all favorites, I mean, most of them favorites for different reasons. I never, I don't tend to go look back a lot. I really want to move forward. I, I f feel I'm about halfway through my career. Um, which is a long career, I guess, if I go another 30 years. But uh, it depends on it depends on how I'll be doing when I'm in my, when I'm 80 something. But I, for me, it's really important that I look look ahead and don't look back.